Hello, I'm Pastor Steve Turner, President of Iowa District West of the Lutheran Church of Missouri Synod. This week, Christians all over the world are remembering Holy Week. It begins with Jesus and his triumphant entry into Jerusalem on Palm Sunday. It takes us to Calvary on Good Friday. And it ends with all of us celebrating with acclamation, Christ is risen, he is risen indeed. Good Friday ends with a definite answer. It is finished. Jesus is dead. Historically, no one questions that reality. It doesn't matter if you are a Christian or even an atheist. It is an historical fact. It is no act of faith to believe that Jesus lived or even that Jesus died on Good Friday. However, on Easter Sunday, the tomb is empty. The women may be afraid, Peter's confused, but let there be no doubt, Jesus is alive. What does this mean? St. Paul gives us the clear answer in Romans chapter 4, 25, where he says, He was delivered over to death for our sins and was raised for our justification. He was delivered over to death. The reason Jesus died is very clear. It is because of us, because of our sin. In the book of Romans, it says in chapter 6, verse 23, the wages of sin is death. You see, sin has a price. It is a price that God chooses to pay himself. In Romans 5, 8, it says, But God demonstrates his own love for us in this, that while we are sinners, Christ died for us. Jesus was delivered over for our sin. And he is raised for our justification. Jesus is alive. And the reason of his resurrection is not simply to say, that Christ is risen, he is risen indeed, there's a purpose for his resurrection. Paul says he's raised for our justification. You see, both guilt and justified are legal terms. On Good Friday, because you and I are guilty, Jesus dies. But Jesus is alive again on Easter Sunday for our Justification. This is the announcement of our acquittal. Not only does Jesus die for our sins, he goes much farther. On Easter Sunday, Jesus declares you and me not guilty. Right now, today, because Jesus truly died, our guilt, our sin died. But by the power of his resurrection, you and I stand before God as justified, not guilty. And so in Him, we have hope for today and hope forever. Christ's resurrection assures us of our own resurrection, that because Jesus lives, we shall live also. I wish you all a very blessed and happy Easter.